eldest son, the Prince of Demons, Herald of Kings, cursed to crown my inferiors. My vengeance will And there we go. That is kind of a 40k reveal from that Warhammer Fantasy reveal event that happened over on Twitch. Now, you're probably wondering, how is that related to Warhammer 40,000? Well, that is none other than Bellacor, and Bellacor is a demon prince who can be taken in both Fantasy and Warhammer 40,000. That is one of the main advantages of actually choosing a demon army when you come to play this game. You can actually play it in both Fantasy and Warhammer 40,000. You've probably got to be able to play it in all the free game modes, which is 40k, um, Age of Sigma, and the upcoming Old World game when that eventually gets released as well. But back to Bellicor, yes, he can be taken in both systems. This is why I'm saying that this is kind of a 40k reveal, even though this reveal was aimed at a Fantasy reveal um, plate. Now, when it comes comes to the model they actually didn't reveal the entirety of the model it was a tease or as we were saying during the stream they basically blue balled us it was like when the silent king first got his little teaser at the end of the 40k um, reveals they just shown off bits of the model and it was up to us then just to hype it up and talk about it and expect what it's going to look like now with this one we can see like the wings in the background there's all skulls on it i'm in no doubt f thinking that this model is going to be absolutely mind-blowing i don't collect chaos at all you know this i'm a space marine fanboy but I think that this is going to be like one of those centerpiece models that really stand out in your army that looks absolutely gorgeous. You can see in the background like some of the images while I've been talking uh, what they really showed off like the chest piece and everything. Uh, the sword is one of the things that really stood out for me. This is like a really really powery slash magic effect type of sword. It really is like a stunning looking weapon in my opinion. Uh, we got to see the loincloth of course. That is another thing we got to see. But the most interesting part of this model personally for me was the base. We actually got to see the base and on that base was a Chaos Warrior. Now, there's no 40k model on that base. Even though that this can be used in Warhammer 40,000, they chose to go with a Chaos model on that base. I'm not saying that this probably is not interchangeable. Maybe in the kit, you will be able to get like a Space Marine or a Chaos Space Marine or an Eldar or an Orc, whatever. Actually, a part of this kit where you can put it on the base to aim it at that 40k audience or it just gives you the option as a kit basher just to put, you know, maybe a, um, a space marine on the base yourself or whatever creature you want to really match it up to your 40k armor. Now that Bellicor is getting this new model, my mind goes to what's next for demons. Again, as I said, you can use demons in AOS and 40k, so it makes sense for them to invest heavily into this range because it can affect both game systems, which means more sales for those systems. So when I think of it now, when I look at like some of the old demon designs, maybe you know we can get some new great demons maybe some new characters actually added to this which again can be taken in aos and 40k um, i'm just hoping now that this is not just the only model that's going to be released and there's a lot more surrounding bellicor coming back in this new model format. Anyway, Chaperunios, that is me done for another video. Thank you for coming. Thank you for watching. I know a lot of people have been asking me about my thoughts about Warhammer Quest, which looks absolutely fantastic. I am kind of concerned about the price, but I'm going to be doing a separate video of that sometime tomorrow where we're going to be going looking in depth at the box, uh, the models in there, because they do have some absolutely gorgeous things um, um, in that. So uh, until then, I'll see you then. Um, I'd love to get your thoughts and feedback on this uh, Bellacore model. What do you think? Are you excited are you happy um put it all down below and we'll have a nice little talk down there as we always do see you now have a great day and bye bye